All right, it's test drive time again. We've got a 2012 CTS here. This is one of the owner's cars. It's got V emblems on it, but it's not a V model at all. It's a 3.6 liter. What we're going to do is go around the car, check for chips, scratches, rust, dents. Anything I see, you'll know about it. Detailed pictures, financing and shipping, maplemotors.com. Should be a pretty easy test drive here. We're going to take it to lunch, actually. The wife came up. She sold another house today. All right, it's about that time. Put a little sensor in the door. Let's take off. Let's go for a ride. Looking around the interior, all you have to do is have the key in your pocket. Got my bag of goodies. It's nice in here. Push the brake, turn the key. Radio works. I have the tigers on. Okay. TV popping up out of the dash. I checked all the tire pressure. We're at 40. I think our tire sensors, the batteries are dead or something. Else. Let's see if we can get some mileage out of this one. I think it was 140. We'll wait on it a second. Let's try some of the goodies. Windows. Not too bad. I'm still learning about this one right now. Looks like we got 141,000 miles. Eighteen miles a gallon. Okay. Yeah, that tire light is not right. I've got 40 pounds at every tire. As long as you got 35 to 40 and all of them looks like a little touch up paint in there that should be good okay well of course the horn works we'll go ahead and try these well that's not the wipers the wipers are over here i've never actually driven this car guys <laughs> i'm still learning it i promise okay let's see if we can get her to come out <laughs> i think she's coming Look, it worked. <laughs> All right, let's open the door for her. This is my wife, guys. She's coming to lunch with us. Her and the baby said they're hungry. You were just testing the horn. <laughs> I was. I was testing the horn, but then I didn't want to get back out because it's still sprinkling. All right, we're going to take off to lunch, and we're going to see how this one runs and drives. All right, guys, we're rolling out now. I don't think we're going to have issues with that. A little backup camera. Ooh, I like it. But we're going forward. <laughs> there it goes. She's got Navi. All the big fancy. Heading on down the road now. Got plenty of gas. Steering feels good. I don't think. We're gonna find too much wrong with this one other than maybe some chips. So be an easy test drive here. And she actually picks up to eat, man. <laughs> That's good. That's real good. Quick. Yeah. <laughs> there tight steering check our brakes nice and smooth a 
oil pressure on this thing's at 50, 55 actually, once you touch the gas. Another tour bus. One thing about Hendersonville, there's a lot of artists here. So you see tour buses leaving all the time. Now basically on this one, we're just gonna drive to lunch. I get a little bit of footage on the way back, but there's no sense. Just be kind of like riding with us to lunch. <laughs> we'll get a few outside shots. It's raining. That's why I picked this one too. Look at the pretty skies over there. You know it's gonna be sunny all week now. Okay, guys, running and driving wise, this one's awesome. If I see anything that stands out, I'll tell you about it. Um, but otherwise, we're in good shape here. We'll at least put her to the floor once now that we've warmed her up. Back in our brakes. Okay. She's kind of quick too, ain't she? Yeah. <laughs> Not too bad. I'll be back with some outside shots. I'm going to light up the undercarriage just like I do on the old school cars. And then when I end the video, I'll do the walk around looking for chips, scratches, rust dents. There's no rust on this one. Uh, check out the interior, listen to the motor real close. And end the video. Any other information, you can call us, 615-822-4444. Look at the detailed pictures on maplemotors.com. Get pre-approved with our financing, and I'll see you in a minute. Now get sunny outside. Picking out the flaws coming your way. Let's go around the front end, which is going to be the worst for flaws. The reason is it's the front end. Chip scratches, all that stuff right off the road here. But looking around the front, you got minor stuff. This is a really clean car, so I actually don't even see hardly anything up here that stands out to me.
tires in good shape wheels look pretty good a little rash around the edge there got something on it from the road I was gonna get the detail guys to get that off it's like some tar or something chips at the bottom rock guard this car is super clean chip in the door there little bugs there front windshield little chip here one there as well and this I'm gonna need sunglasses again I'm trying to stare into this paint sun is bright right now I do welcome it though it was cold there for a second coming up on the back end tread on those back tires. It's like a little scuff here. Should come out. Scratch here at the bottom though. That's not going to come out. Like chip here and scratch. Up here in the front it's kind of small over the windshield again small chip some of them are too small they won't pop up I guess if they're that small they're irrelevant right <clears throat> well, I knew this was going to be easy. Let's go ahead and open the door here. It's got a sensor there you just push on. The Bose system. The seals look good.
I got it dirty, didn't Starts right up. Now your tire sensor light is going to be on. I think maybe the sensors are bad because I've already checked all the air pressure and it hasn't hasn't changed. Air air pressures have 40 all the way around. And it should be good on there. Um, but it says service tire monitor system. So I'm gonna say check right front tire pressure using inflator kit and trunk. It says it's 23, but it's not right. I literally checked them all. So, and the heat's hot. Radio. Yeah. Candy Lane. <laughs> Motor's just nice and quiet in this one. Not a whole lot to see. It's all plastic under here. Just a whole bunch of covers. Shove you down in there. But it's quiet. Guys, detail pictures, finance, and shipping available at maplemotors.com. Go there, check it out, hit subscribe. This is out of my norm. You can see, normally I'm a, working on all these classics. Well, it just so happens one of the owners wanted to sell his caddy. So lucky you, you get to pick it up. Give us a call, 615-822-4444. You can get pre-approved with our financing. You can get a ship it quote. It's all at maplemotors.com. Be sure to go there, check it out. And, of course, every Monday I'm updating with new rides. Thanks, guys.